So I'm sure everybody has already heard about the Sonic X Roblox collaboration. Roblox is no stranger to having amazing Sonic fan games after all. So I'm sure Sega sponsored the right developer- so right off the bat, the game starts at a slow ass speed. Not a great start considering this is a Sonic game. But don't worry, you'll go fast, eventually. So how this game works and how the game rewards you is by moving. With the step counting system, and also by collecting whatever these are. And with that, I just explained 90% of the game. So first off, this is a speed simulator. If I'm correct, this gameplay has always been a concept in Roblox. And it's basically just a reskin of an already made game slash concept. I'm kinda playing the original where this thing is based off of and yeah it's so it's so similar race feature rebirth time to jump to go higher like i mentioned before this game rewards you with a faster speed and movement but how does it reward exploration well good question for your curiosity you get rewarded with gacha machine and two cosmetic skins yeah this game has a gacha that's why they brought back these boys for what am i gonna get what am i gonna get uncommon that is not what I wanted to see. If you ever played Roblox before, this gameplay shouldn't feel too unique or exciting or new. Slapping the same Sonic franchise into another game for profit. Something Sega has been doing for quite some time already. The game can be fun, so it's just a bit disappointing that this is a merely quick cash grab that got Sega to license them. Sega has quite the good record for rewarding Sonic fans fan games and just for being a cool company in general and i still believe they're a good company i just think there's other roblox developers who deserve the spotlight in for this one if you like mindlessly grinding or have a gambling addiction this is the game for you even the developers of this game probably admitted that this was a very rushed project and yeah i can see that <laughs> so there's about four worlds to explore and some are really short obbies that punish you for being too fast the four worlds are nothing special in particular, they're just another area to grant points in. The gachas reward you with passives that, you guessed it, it helps you become faster. Faster. One other weird gameplay feature is races. Every once in a while you get the notification notifying you that a race will start soon. If you decide to join it, you race against other players. But most of the races usually end up like this. I'm sure I can beat these guys. Oh, ho, ho, ho. that's what I like can really bring up gameplay wise. The only fun thing to do in this game is going fast, which brings me to this gameplay mechanic called rebirth. Once you reach level 50, you'll stop leveling up, unless you sacrifice yourself and rebirth yourself to as an even greater, more powerful, faster being. And I am, I've been rebirthed, now I am. I'm this fast now. This is how you start off the game at this speed. I'm not even joking. That is literally how fast everybody starts. You know, you don't get to have fun right away. No, no, you don't get to have fun with more cash. I get this mechanic I am actually kind of familiar with. Point is, after all the hard work you did, all that grinding, your reward is to do it all over again. But this time you'll be faster. Yeah, this game kind of sucks. This game kind of sucks. Dick. So yeah, there's not much to do besides run around, rebirth, run around, rebirth, run around, rebirth, run around, rebirth, run around, rebirth. This game seems to be doing extremely well regardless. So I'm glad Sonic is finally taking some W's after such tragedies. I'm just a little disappointed. The game runs and works super well, but Roblox has so much more to offer than this. And with gameplay like this, the only problem will be that it will get boring eventually. And I'm sure that's already been a problem. This isn't a Sonic game. It's a game with Sonic in it. I just hope this is an opportunity for Sega to keep supporting the game and maybe considering other developers to work with. Because boy, they are very good developers in Roblox. But yeah, I give this game a 6 out of 10. It isn't just about the speed. Before the video ends, I would like to give a special shout out to my girlfriend. She's basically responsible for all the art you see on this channel. So yeah, so we've successfully upgraded our staff from one to two members. Let's go. I don't want to sound like a one you bitch, but recording, editing, making thumbnails can get a bit time consuming and a bit exhausting. So really special shout out to her. She's been helping me a lot, you know, getting the thumbnails out faster and helping out with the graphic designing. And it's been a huge help. Yeah, special thanks to her. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one. There are some things that are Sonic that Sonic regrets, like making that dumb sand he'll choke in sonic forces <laughs> yep it's also in the lore that he regrets sonic 06 entirely <laughs> i mean it's kind of the thing that's rough it's gotcha basically gambling yep but legal